everyone. This is Piperita. This is going to be the first time I ever uh, record a let's play of a video game. Um, planning on putting this on my YouTube channel. Um, it's kind of empty right now. I actually was planning to record this when it first came out back in 2013 and shoot off my YouTube channel that way. But things didn't quite work out and I didn't get started until very recently when a friend um, who also has a YouTube channel sort of helped inspire me to get off my lazy butt and get started with what I really wanted to do. So yeah, I'm not sure um, how commentary will be. Um, I'm kind of a quiet person so I guess we'll just see how it kind of goes. I did play this game when it first came out on the 360 and I did defeat it. Um, I was really terrible at the multiplayer back then. Uh, since then I've played a few um, first person shooters, uh, mainly Destiny. Um, I'll be doing some recording on that as well. But yeah, let's see how this goes. Um, I'll try normal because when I first played I tried easy and did pretty good then. A famous explorer once said, the extraordinary is in what we do, not who we are. I'd finally set out to make my mark, to find adventure. But instead, adventure found me. I still remember when this trailer first came out on E3 a long time ago, and I saw it, I like got an insane amount of goosebumps watching. I was so excited. I was never really into Tomb Raider when I was a lot younger. It just, it didn't appeal to me, I guess. I was always into a lot more fantasy-based games, but this was like the first Tomb Raider game I was really excited about. find something. Something that keeps us going. Pushes us. a lot of animals. <sighs> and very meticulously placed skulls. It's like all of the horror, horror games, horror movies, they all have like wonderful interior decorators. hair is like all in all all of her bangs and stuff is still facing the right direction.
play. Subtitles. Definitely. Okay, that's good. Got to get down. Bonk. I can't die like this. It's always seemed like a bad idea to me. It's gonna hurt. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. There we go. events are the enemy. Oh, 
Nope. Not yet. Um. I thought I burnt that. Maybe not. There we go. Okay. Come on. Need a better controller. Oh, oh. Did it? Yeah, I got some debris. Probably not enough, though. stuff in there. Let's see if that was enough. If I remember correctly, I have to set it on fire. Fun part. Gotta get out of here. You can do it, Laura.
Not there, obviously. They must have gone inland. Not with those crags. This really should be called instead of Piper plays Tomb Raider, it should be Piper dies a lot. Almost there. Oh shit. Really glad there's this little tutorial at the beginning because I would not remember how to do all this. Please don't run off the edge. That would be my luck. your ankles. Sam! They must have come this way. Sam? Roth? Can anyone hear me? Some of that could be really useful, but... Okay. Come on. Oh. Ouch. I see you. I'll be back for you. I don't remember what they're called, and I don't remember where all of them are, but I'll be shooting them. Looks abandoned. Convenient fireplace. Is anyone listening? Please respond. She's shaking. I did always like the small realistic touches like that they do in video games, because a lot of times you don't think about stuff like that. Or in video games you don't think about stuff like that. Exposure being so dangerous. She kind of stays in a tank top the whole game, if I remember. But, you know, small favors.
Here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and ancestor of yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously, I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you, Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay, okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know? How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? But it's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamata... No one believes Yamata is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamata. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. You don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. <sighs> Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place has a bad energy. Bad storms, more like, makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> but all these <laughs> stereotypes. The stories about Queen Himiko Jeez. say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously Enough. cons... Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? Safe spot, isn't it? I think. Maybe. Can't remember exactly. Or checkpoint, I should say. <laughs> oh, it's a deer! Convenient. How convenient. Go ahead and pick these up. Good. Well, that worked. I can do this. If this thing still works, just remember Roth's training. You can have the best form and technique in the world, but it won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. 
so hungry. I need to find something to eat. see nothing. Of course he's gone. Oh, shit. Than being able to attack me. That's what I should name my video on YouTube, huh? Tomb Raider Part 1 A Search for Food. hurt. Can I just like... There we go. That was way more complicated than it should have been. Sorry. You're not sorry, you're hungry! Delicious. impressive with just a bow tip. Right, back to camp. Alright, Martha. You won't always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. If you can learn to read the land and the stars, you'll always be able to find your way home. Part two, finding my way back to the camp. Upstream, I'm gonna guess. Well, there's that. What am I looking for? Wow, I'm special. Okay, there we go. Alright, there we go.
controller. Work with me here. Oh, there we go. Okay. Sorry about that. My controller decided to turn itself off. Alright. This is Conrad Roth, captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Roth! Lara! You're alive! Easy, easy. Are you okay? What happened? I remember the beach, and then it went black, and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Roth, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. <sighs> Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay. Music. Alright, I'm going to end it here. If y'all are watching from Twitch, I would appreciate it if y'all followed me. I'll be continuing this. Um, it'll probably be daily, every other day kind of a thing. And then, if you're watching this from my YouTube channel, please subscribe. I would appreciate it. And I'll continue probably weekly updates between editing the videos. But yeah, thanks guys.